Wait, are you sure it's okay to do this? Yes, I'm 100% fine. I mean, it, just don't worry about it. But you know what will happen if I get caught if anyone sees us. I'm supposed to be running away. I know, and none of what you said is going to happen, okay? Okay. What if Camille sees us? She'll kill me. It's okay. I mean, I really like you. I just don't want Camille to be mad at me. Camille and I broke up a long time ago. Remember? I don't know. I just... It just... We could get caught and what would happen if... I mean, I, I just... What? Macy? It, it's... What? Camille, it's, it's not what you think. Wait, this is all my fault. You. You little piece of... I just can't believe you. And Macy. Macy Golden Spark, I thought we were friends. We are. I I didn't even You didn't what? Make out with my boyfriend? Come on, you guys broke up over a year ago. No, we didn't. Uh, um You told me you guys broke up over a year ago. Were you lying? Um Oh sure, you expect me to believe that, so I'm sorry. Macy, when I first met you, I should have called the cops instead of letting you stay with me. I mean, what was I thinking? But you don't understand. Oh right, I don't understand. Cammy. I, I I kissed her first. She didn't kiss me. Why should I believe either one of you? For all I know, you guys could have been dating behind my back for however long, even longer than I've been dating you. Camille, I would never do anything to hurt you. Yeah, Macy? It's too late. I'm calling the cops and I'm gonna tell them that Macy Golden Spark is at my house. And she's been living there for a year. Settle. No, please, you can't do it. I can't go back to my life before this. Well, you should have thought of that before you made up with my boyfriend. Camille, wait. <laughs> Camille, please. What are you doing in my house? Oh, um, this house. Oh, no, you see, I was just, um, uh, sh stopping by. Uh-huh. And, um, uh, my, uh, best friend lives here, yeah. Um, uh, Annalise. Yeah, she lives here. Really? I'm the only one who lives here. This is my house. You know what, maybe I should just call the cops. I mean, that would be a little smarter than trying to deal with you. No, 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 please, please do not call the cops. Okay, I'm starting to get a little freaked out. Are you some, like, mass criminal and that's why you don't want to, me to call the cops? No, it's not it at all, I promise. Look over there, it's a kitten on a tree! What? Wait, no, please don't call the cops, no! Get your paws off me! Help! 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 <clears throat> Just give me five minutes to explain. I promise I'm not a criminal. <clears throat> oh, right. Why should I trust you? Because I may see Golden Spark. <gasps> 
Dr. Mason Goldensworth, oh my dog, I'm your biggest fan ever. Is this a dream? Or am I dead? I think, did I, am I, am I in heaven? Hello, someone please help me, please tell me this is not happening. Can you get off of me, please? Oh. Look, I will buy you anything if you will please just shut up. Okay, I'm sorry, it's just, you could have started with that. You seem really creepy like some serial killer or something. Ew, why would I be compared to a serial killer? Right, but if you're Macy Goldenspark, then why are you here? Oh, it's, um, it's a long story. Well, obviously, you have nowhere to go if you're trying to break in my house, so spill it. Okay, fine. Once upon a time, I was a little girl. Girl. Oh, yeah, I love this song. Really? Sorry, I just, I just seriously had to do that. Okay, once upon a time, I was born January 1st, 1997. Not that far, just why are you here? Okay, well... You see, my mom lost her job and blamed it all on me, and then she brought up something about my dad, who, um, uh, uh, yeah, anyways, I couldn't take it, and I had, I just had to run away from here. She said I was going to have to move, just leave everything, start over, basically live a new life, and I just can't do that. You know, that kind of sounds like what happened to me. What do you mean? I ran away too, because... My dad divorced my mom, and then my mom ended up, um, yeah, and I just, I didn't know what to do, so I came here, and I found this old abandoned place, which used to be a hotel, and I sort of just kind of live here now. Huh. Well, is there any possible way that, you know, I could stay here just until I find, you know, just until I, you know, like, until I decide to leave and find my own place. No. What? Why? Jeez, you were no fun at all. I was just kidding. Didn't you hear the sarcasm in my voice? Okay, you obviously do not know what sarcasm means. Touche. Okay, fine. You can stay for however long you need to. Thank you. But you can't tell anyone I'm here. You can't use my name. You can't tell anyone I'm here. You can't go around saying there's someone living in my house because my mom has a search party after me and if I get busted, it, this whole thing will be messed up. No, I was gonna take Instapoodle pictures. No Instapoodle, no bark, no nose bug. Ugh, fine. You know, from, you know, I first thought I was gonna hate you. But now, I think we're gonna be great friends. Aw, thanks. Oh, and you're sleeping on the floor, by the way. Come on, let's go. Really? Wait, hey! Camille, I'm so sor- Sorry? No, Camille, you can't. Please. Please don't. 911, what's your emergency?